Some days I wake up and I don't feel like doing anything. That's because the stress of moving from one point to another can be such a bore. So sometimes I want to stay on my bed, but I need to get work done. From booking my bus for meetings, to arranging official meetings, to getting a space for seminars. <sighs> what about getting a very good event coverage company with good equipment that can do everything I want. But hey, all of that is in the past now because I found a place I can get everything that I need in one. At Swat TV Studios, the render is a variety of services from photography at its very best to well-equipped multi-purpose studio space for any type of event or video recording, from television shows, live music shows, or comedy shows, to mention a few. Did I mention that it can also cover your events with the most efficient equipment, as well as offer live streaming services for any event? This is the special part. They can also train you to become a pro in videography and photography. So, I woke up today and I feel like doing everything thanks to Swag TV Studio. All right, good day, ladies and gentlemen. Of course, my name is Omoje So Alfred, and I'm seeing the swacking. I'm the boss of all bosses. I happen to be among the very most innocent guys on the face of planet Earth. Like you just see, I tell if I came, I saw, and of course, I conquered. This is what next week the boss of all bosses. I have one of the most finest comedian in South South. Now, somebody will say always comedian. Yes, last week we had um Diamond Sprite. Of course, he said something so striking. He said um, the ten million that the governor gave to him. Is actually a blessing and also a cause. And um, the rivers people seems to um, it gets some of them a little bit offended. They say, "Oh, why would you say that? Why would you say that?" And the commotion was was something else. And today we decided to bring someone, but this person this time did not really benefited from the ten million naira. But of course, he went along his way to say, "I want to do something for myself." And he is putting up an event called uh, the Calling of Advisor. All right, and of course, um, this one is said, um, yes, I do. Um, ladies and gentlemen, please put it up for the one and only advice on the platform. How about you, sir? Right, most How are you doing? Good. All right, looking so fresh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, first of all, let's stress. <laughs> all right, first of all, let's start. Who is advisor? Okay, advisor is a uh, is a master for compare. Okay. He's stand up comedian, okay. very spontaneous stand up okay. comedian. Okay. A content creator. Mm -hmm. And the son of a praying mother. <laughs> you know, we need to put down. When you're not saying that my prayer, they keep me going. Okay. You understand? Right. Yeah. My name is Bright Uzoma, aka Advisor. Okay. In the region of Imo State, mm -hmm. a lot to be precise. Mm -hmm. I was born, I'm still paying house rent mm -hmm. in Port mm -hmm. I'm a graduate of biotechnology, mm -hmm. the prestigious Federal University of Technology over a photo. Okay. Yeah. So, I so you're, not, you're not committed that I don't fear people. You just uh, speak. It's not like I don't fear good people. Good or bad, you just say no, the no, way. No, no, no. It's not like I don't fear people. <laughs> okay. Um, but why would I fear people? <laughs> you, um, you don't have anything like Godfather in Puerto Rico. No, 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 no. It's not like I, God is already my father. Uh -huh. I'm a very loyal person, but. Okay. But you don't fear people. I don't fear people. I try my best not to step on toes, but I fear no feet. Hmm. You understand? Okay. I don't need to be, fe to, to be scared of anybody because I'm always sincere. Hmm. You know, in this part of the world or in Africa, mm. when you are real, people see like you're arrogant. All right. When you don't want them to use you, they see like you're arrogant. Okay. When you don't want them to put their fingers in your eye, they say this guy, he has pride, he's arrogant. Okay. But at the same time, these people that say you have pride, they're still paying you to come mm. for their event. Okay. They're still paying you to do something with them. So they're not saying that those that are complaining are those that want to use you okay. for free. 
But those paying you know that you pure businessman mm. and we're doing business comedy. We're not doing comedy for fun. All right. Now, now, now you say those that see you as pride are the people that don't want to pay yeah, you. Can yeah. you explain that? Uh, you know, when someone to use you and uh, it's okay, adversa, uh, I want you to come and do my event for me. Then it was okay. The adversa you know yesterday, you know the adversa of today. Mm. I'm growing. I need to pay tithes. Right. I need to help my family. Right. This, this is what I'm doing to, to make a living for myself. Mm. Now, pay me this particular man. They tell you, uh, he has pride. What is he even saying? You want to take money from us. But you, if I call you to come and do something for me, you tell me I should pay you. Okay. Let me say, for instance, in the church, mm. because you're a comedian or you're a musician, they want you to sing for free. Oh, okay. But the tailors in church don't soak blood for free. Huh? The furniture in church don't come and do free chairs for, for members of the church. Mm. The, the, the doctors in church, even the church hospital, you will pay. Okay. But you as a comedian, they want you to come to church and do it for free. Mm. They don't understand that comedy is a business. All right. Nigerians don't understand that comedy is a business. So I'm trying to make them understand that this thing I'm doing is a business. Mm. And in business, we have terms and conditions. Okay. Uh. Okay, when you talk about terms and conditions of Asha, let's talk a little bit about your event before we take you out from that circle. The calling of, of, of Avisa, this is not the first edition. So which edition is this right now? This is like the fifth edition. Okay, give me your experiences so far. <laughs> tell us about the first, tell us about the second, uh, the third, and the fourth. Okay, the first edition was in Uwari. Okay. Uh, that one like the... Let me see, we will try, we'll try to ask ourselves if we are ready to do business or comedy. Okay. Because then, in a way, they don't pay gate fee. But <laughs> <laughs> okay. we would love, you come to an event center, you allow them to do their thing, buy their drinks, okay. and enjoy themselves. All right. And spend money. And spend money. Okay. You understand? Mm. So I did that one in a way, and it was cool, but not cool to my test. Okay. You understand? And I decided to come back to Port Harcourt. Okay, I went to Abia State. I did in Abia State. Okay. The same format I use in the worry. Okay. We'll get a, a, an open bar. Okay. Do your stuff. But I didn't pick those ones as the, the show. The show. All right. So the first one I can call the show is the one I did in Port Harcourt. That was 2016. All right. Yeah, somewhere around at the George. Okay. Do you understand? Then we, we did the whole thing. On that fateful day, <laughs> there was heavy shower. Oh, okay. The rain was something else, but oh, okay. Shower showers of blessing. Showers of blessing, but <laughs> me, I see it like nature. I don't complain. Oh, right. But if I do events and it, it, it doesn't rain, I see it like it's an issue. Okay. Let let nature take place. Oh. You understand? So on that day, that fifth day, I had the likes of Sam and Son. Then Emanuela was there. So Emanuela of Mackenzie was on that B. Oh. Sam and Son was on that B. Akoro was on that B. I, the combo phone is on that B. Okay, then I was still doing more of gospel comedy. Mm. You understand? But then I was thinking like, ah, this church, this church thing will, will really pay off. You understand? And I said, okay, let me go through the church and do the event. So it was more like the church audience. You understand? Then in 2017, we had Josh Tufani, Kevin Saab, MOP, and a lot, lot of comedians. That one to see the church concept but this 20 okay now i went i went to dubai i did the event in dubai but not the church concept anymore we did dubai we did west africa tour with the calling of, of advisor mm -hmm. we did ghana togo and Benin republic then i did one in Kenya. so now we're back to portaco to do the yes i do edition which is the fifth edition and this yes i do edition because um, people have been disturbing me, advice. when will you marry? When will you marry? Why are you single? Okay. You are making money. Money is making you. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you not married? Mm. So this year's Adu edition, I think um, it will look like my wedding reception at the center. Uh, yeah. So I, 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 are you saying that that same day you're saying yes, I do to the beautiful lady? And I want to say yes, I do. I don't want her to say yes, I do. I don't want to need her. I'm going to spend it in the morning. I want her to need her. I say, Father, thank you for bringing this young man to my life. Okay. You know that? Yeah, on that day, we, we unveil the, the Mrs. Advisor. No, 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 no. It has a different between unveil and there's a different between. You said something. You said, it's, um, yes, I do. Um, 
actually might be your reception. Yeah. So meaning there will be a church service that morning saying, this lady, uh, today we could say we're coming for advice. No, 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 no. That is not what I Nobody mean. Nobody showed the no, that's not what I mean. What do you that mean? day, I will propose to the girl. To the girl. Right, to so the lady. So whoever the lady is right now, we I don't know her. At the don't moment. Know her. But before that day, All right. I will know her. Okay. So why, why should people attend this, the calling of advice? Uh, this is the most friendly comedy show we have in South South. All right. Uh, it, the calling of advice is not just a show, it's a product. Okay. I don't call it program, I call it product. Okay. Because we are not coming to just sell humor. We're coming here to network. Okay. The show, we have a lot of kings and queens coming with the show. Okay. So we're coming there to network, we're coming there to meet. It's just a gathering of families, of kings, okay. of kings, okay. uh, of kings and queens. Better. You understand? So you're coming there to network, you're also coming there to learn. Mm. Because the comedians are, that are on my B are not your regular comedians. Mm. Are not comedians that will just come to the show and beg you for money. Oh. Nobody's coming there to beg you for money. Mm. We're coming there to sell 100% humor. Oh. So it's going to be a night of 100% entertainment. Okay. And you love it. And that day, I will honor my dad. A lot of people don't know that my dad acted Willy Willy. Oh. So that oh. day, I want to honor my dad. Oh. So you, yeah, my dad have tried. Oh. Uh, you know, back then, we live with it die and I will kill and then kill and <laughs> So it's time to honor my dad. All right, all right. So you're begging him on stage that yeah. day also. All right, letting people know about him. All right, let, let, let's uh, shift back a little bit out from the show because, of course, we're going to come back for you to tell us the ticket and where we can get the ticket and everything and the actual date for the show. But before we go there, advice that you always do post on social media, and I had a conversation with one or two persons and they said you always believe that people are after you. How to that is? <laughs> I don't always believe. <laughs> you no, know, people say some things and it's funny. Yeah? I don't always believe that people are after me. Uh, you know, when you have something to offer, people will definitely come for you. Okay. You understand? I I know the grace I carry. Uh, the people say I always believe people are after me. Maybe they have tried to and it did not work. <laughs> because for you to for you to see such thing or to to put that thing in your mind, yeah. that means there's something that's wrong with you. Okay. okay. Because that means you have some interior motive. Okay. Do you understand? Oh. You know, we find ourselves in 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 an environment where people call you my blood, my blood, but they're not your blood. We assume a lot. A lot of people call your friends and not your friends. Okay. That's why in this generation you can be dating somebody and the person is not dating you. Oh. Okay. You know, a lot of people are just dating themselves. Oh. You know, and the people who call our blood. Okay. Why I tell you something and say, bro. They do this thing to me, and you say, nobody do it. Or you say, ah, who do who go do this kind of thing to you? Mm. Tomorrow you go back and say, you always feel that people have time. Mm. Yeah, there's some things that will happen to you. It's not ordinary. Mm. Yeah, the life is very spiritual, so you need to be vigilant. And because they know I'm vigilant, they now change like this guy. Maybe this guy feel belong to somewhere. He was like wearing white. That's why they know you're white. <laughs> You like wearing white, the sky is white, the sun is white, everything white, 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 white. They believe you have involved in something. something. Because you are doing well. Mm. They are crying. Yeah. Just like during the lockdown, I came back from UK. Mm. They were crying, no money. I wasn't crying. Yeah. I'm not crying because of I'm rich. Why? But because of I know my place in God. Mm. I'm not just a child of God. Okay. I'm a son of God. I have inheritance. Mm. You understand? So I'm not just a child of God. Mm. So when they cry... You say comedians are not making money. Hmm. Comedians are not doing events. I'm doing events. And you're making money. So I'm not making money. Hmm. They don't know how to build networking. Life is all about networking. Okay. Even going to heaven is through Christ. Okay. You understand? You can't go to heaven alone. Hmm. So you need to learn how to build your, your, your network. Hmm. I know how to build my network. I have time. So oh, 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 talking about building network, would you say that Toka Olik hmm. is actually a platform that brought you out to the Never. life? Never. How will you say Toka Oli brought me out? No, because we, we know that you started with Toka Oli. No, I didn't start with Toka Oli. So where are you been? Where did you belong to? I didn't start with Toka Oli. So Toka Oli never converted to your They do. They did, sorry. Okay. But you can't say I started from Toka Oli. All right. Even the people you call Ellis Comedian, but I'm bigger than them, and older than them in industry. Be careful. I'm telling you, I'm bigger than that. Than <laughs> oh, be careful. Be who? careful. All right. Now, when you say that even those we call an A-list artist, yeah. they will even say that you're bigger than Yes. Them. Can you, do you have a proof of that, sir? <laughs> okay, let me use my chairman as an example. Mm -hmm. Apollo was my friend. Okay. Today, Apollo is my boss. All right. Myself, Apollo, and last brother, we are in Comedy Challenge together. 2009. Okay. And some of the guys you see in Podaco, they were not doing comedy then. 
Right. You understand? Because you see someone up there, doesn't mean he was there before me. Okay. Let me do like of Mr. Funny. Mm. I was there before Mr. Funny. Oh, but today, Mr. Funny's brand is bigger than the adversary brand. Mm. So I would like to say Mr. Funny is my senior colleague. No. What would you call him there? He's a colleague. Okay. Do you understand? Yeah. The people you see, oh, you say, uh, this a one is A-list, this one is B-list. Me, I don't have any list. I'm in grace list. Okay. Do you understand? They are not there before me. All right. They had opportunities because of their age. Mm. Do you understand? Now, their friend, their friend circle mm. is advanced, more advanced than mine. Okay. So their friends were empowered then, so they could push them okay. to be where they are today. Now, my friends are growing. My network is growing. That's how I can do Aztec. Yeah, because your network is going. Yes. Right. Before now, I can't do Aztec. Okay. Before you do a show and put table for two million naira, have they paid you two million naira before right. as a comedian? Okay. If they have not paid you, don't do it. Okay. You know, pay, nobody wants to waste his money. Mm. Now, 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 this other part is something I want you to be careful when you answer. Now, you I'm, said, I'm very, very okay. careful. Now, I'm now, fearless. Now, you said Toka Oli did not, is not, uh, the platform did not brought you out to the lamplight. All right, let's take that as a credit on your own side. Now, uh, can, I, can I answer? Can I cut you, please? Yeah. Okay. When you say Toka Oli, Toka Oli, apart from Keo Baba, which other Toka Oli person do you know? Now, but 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 they say they are, they are the ones that hold the real estate in terms of entertainment. And Assumption entertainment. is the lowest level of knowledge. Okay. Thank you. But is your own concept of sold out? Sure. Yeah. Okay, fine. When you say uh, my soul, my show is sold out. Because we've seen a lot of events in real estate and everybody goes sold out, sold out. And the next day you're expecting to see a different a different artist, a different look, a different stuff, and you are not saying that, and you want to answer self questions. Now you hear my show is sold out, and then the person is trying to get funds to sort out one or two, and you answer say, what is the concept of sold out? Um, Your show is coming up very soon. And I will not write sold out. And even till now, I have not sold one ticket. I think we will to buy tickets. Oh, you're just saying it because you wanted to, you wanted to, you to buy you know, you wanted to buy one Nobody can sell that anywhere. Oh. Let me just be sincere to you. Let's let's be real. Okay. Entertainment business is big. All oh, right. Wow. Now people see those things as packaging. Okay. If they are really selling at all, they are really selling at this event center. Mm. Some of them I know, they love fame, they love the they love glory, they love they are entitled. Oh, you wow. understand? If they are really selling at those event centers. Some of them don't buy skyscraper by now. Oh. You understand? Oh. I'm trying my best to do an event with zero debt. And I don't want, at the end of the event, anybody's gossiping me or calling me, the advisor is owing me one nera. You understand? Oh. I'm trying to do this event with ease. Okay. That's why I'm eating. I'm enjoying myself while I'm doing the event. No tension at all. You understand? Yeah. So when it says so that event, so that event, it's a comedy show we are doing. Hmm. You're selling the product. If I sold my whole product out to the world, what about tomorrow? Okay. Do you understand? No. Whether you sell the whole hundred percent, you sell still on two hundred percent. It's not my business. Okay. I'm not doing competition with anybody. All right. You know that. If I have two persons to the glory of God, if I have one, million, I'm going to okay, you don't have two persons. All right. This yeah. the point. We come to advise her to give us detail about his event, the venue, uh, the time, and of course, let us know where to get the ticket and the prices of the ticket, sir. Okay. The calling of advice, sir. The yes, I do edition will be holding on Sunday, the eleventh day of June, at. Aztec at on Stadium Road, Portacourt. The red carpet will start by 5 p.m. Okay. And the show will kick start immediately, not just, not, not African man time, right. by 6 p.m. and to allow to like 1 a.m. Because the next day is public holiday. Right. So the, the good thing about the show that on the 10th of June is Champions League Finals. <laughs> on the 11th of June, is a calling of advice. On the twelfth of June is Democracy <laughs> Day, public holiday. <laughs> so it's a long holiday, a long is a vacation. Yeah. Depending on who you are coming out with, <laughs> <laughs> it's a vacation. Okay. So the ticket is just regular is five thousand naira. Okay. The VIP is twenty thousand. Mm. And the gold table for ten is one million naira. Mm. And the platinum table for ten. It's two million naira. Okay, now I'm being careful when when people in River State talk about their show on this platform, and I will always want to ask them: those outside River State, those after outside Nigerian, can they have access to your show? Yeah, that was that. That would be after the show. 
Okay, after the show. Yeah, because what we are doing, like I said, we are not doing a program or a show. We are doing a product. Okay, product. Okay. So after the show, they will call mass production. Okay. So we'll give to them the go to our social media platform okay. to watch and enjoy the show. Okay. They can also buy tickets even since they are not coming to support the show. <laughs> they are families. That is the family show. They should buy tickets. They can buy tickets at www.telafrica.com. Even though they will not call, let them not buy. Can you, can you take that, that, that platform again? www.telafricaticket.com. <laughs> www. All right. But they are buying tickets. Support me. Don't judge by my size. <laughs> All the glitters are not good. No so that. Don't try this too. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, of course, I want to say thank you, advisor, for coming. But those of you in the state, those of you in the South South region, I call on you to support advisor. Um, advisor is, um, of course, they say he's a fearless comedian. I know I've had one or two encounter with him before. Would I say he's fallout? Of course, one or two. <laughs> but he is that person that is is fearless. Okay, and of course, I think I love him for that. And he said something striking. Okay, which um, you're, you're going to. The only way for you to enjoy those one is maybe uh, for those of you watching us right now, maybe you can go back to our, uh, to our platform on YouTube to watch the interviews again because he says some striking, striking keynote, keynote things. I want to say thank you for coming, Advisor. So Please much. encourage him. Make sure you get your ticket. Make sure you are at that event center. Well, those within outside the state and they want to come, do you have any arrangement for them to come in? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have some companies working with me. All right. Like if you're coming outside Port Harcourt, yeah. you want to lodge in a hotel mm. because of my events they're coming for. Yeah. Uh, Osborne Resort will mm. give you 35% discount, discount okay. because you're coming for my event. Mm. Then uh, Swiss Madison, mm. the one at Peter Little, okay. will give you 30% discount All right. because you're coming for the event. So okay. if you're coming outside Port Harcourt, I'll put a call across. Okay. I'll see you too. All right. River was... State is safe. <laughs> Forget right. what you say on social media. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, before we call it over up today, you know these are traditional and are custom for every artist on this platform as long as you're from River State to answer this particular question. Mm. Advisor, mm. do you think River State has what it takes to raise an artist from grassroots, take the artist to the top, and sustain the artist without the artist going to Lagos? Yes. And also, that's number one. Secondly, do you think that the 10 million that Governor Wiki gave to people changed the life of entertainers in those states. Okay, first of all, River State has the capacity mm. to raise an artist mm. to the top. Mm. The, the question is, is the artist willing to work? To sustain himself. To sustain himself. When you went to Lagos Advisor, so why are you acting I don't base in Port Harcourt. You base, yeah. No, I operate from Port Harcourt. All right. All right. <laughs> all right. All right. You get my so, point? So you see his funny attitude now. It's not funny. That's why people <laughs> don't know networking. All right. When you go to Lagos, when you call, if you ask any big comedian in Lagos, who are the comedians you know in, in Port Agado, they say, Arenze Baba, advisor. All right. Because of my networking. Okay. I know how to network. I don't go there to beg them a platform. I go there to perform. You have talent. It will show. All right. You understand? Okay. You don't just stay in one place in Port Agado and find chairman. Bros, nobody know you. They don't ask you fame. Okay. Do you understand? I've done 30 states inside the United States. Mm. I've done eight countries. I will do more. Mm -hmm. yeah. Then for the second question, the 10 million naira, when you give a rich man 10 million naira, mm. he will double the money. Right. And when you give a poor man 10 million naira, he will finish the money. Right. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. when, the government, when the governor gave them, when the government gave them, or when the government gave them that money, mm. some of them use it well. Okay. Some of them do not use it well. It's free money. All right. So because it's free money, you didn't work for it, so you will not value it. Do you understand? Yeah. But at least the government have done something, or the past government have done something, but we have a new government now. Yeah. They have done something to say, we are with you guys. Mm. Whether you see like eye service or, or not, but they did something yeah. to help. 10 million naira is not 10,000 naira. Uh -huh. 10 million naira is not 1 million naira. Mm. If you give 10 million naira to a businessman, he mm. would double that money to 100 million. Okay. So because you gave it to someone that don't know the value for money, they could not double it. They could not double it. Okay. So you don't need to blame the government. So he tried. The government tried. All right. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, before advice, I leave the platform. What do you have to tell your guests concerning your show and of course those watching from within the country and outside the country? Come and enjoy yourself. I don't like when we buy a table, two million naira, and your commander will be cracking joke, you don't laugh. If I spent two million naira for sure from the hall, so the entire they love to come. Come, let's enjoy ourselves. Right. We know they have removed subsidy. 
<laughs> people are complaining there's no fuel, there's no lights. Go and let's have fun. And I promise you, it's going to be a night of 100% entertainment. Okay. My comedians I have the likes of the Stalker, I have Akpororo, I have Mr. Po, I have MOP, I have Danny Spry, I have Arenze Baba. We have the Jagaban of Comedy, Busy Mad, and my PA, the Observer. You know, as an advisor, you don't need another, another advisor to so have Observer. <laughs> you know, and I have myself. And believe me, it's going to be a night of 100% humor. Oh, wow. No dull moment. You will enjoy it. So we'll give you value for your money. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's what we call it to wrap for today. Don't forget, my name is Omoje. So, Alfred, and this is what next, of course, we the boss of all boss. Advice I want to say thank you for coming. We really mm -hmm. want to say thank you for coming. Like I always say, those of you watching us on DSTV, don't forget that you can also join us on Start Time. Okay, it's channel 109. And of course, on Go TV, it's channel 92. And those of you in Lagos, of course, you're watching us free to air, but I want was to say, maybe you find yourself in a different environment and say, I don't want to miss the show on DSTV channel 252. And of course, those of you in River State, oh, I hope you're enjoying it from your local platform. And that is the reason why you must come out to support the calling of advisor. Yes, I do. Whoever the lady is, I don't want to say, I don't, I don't, I don't want to say much, okay, but you just know yourself, all right? Well, sorry if it happened that that day you're not the person and some other person, um, I don't know what will happen because maybe some of you will be thinking, ah, I am the one, I am the, I am the first lady. Um, maybe that they will not discover that you're the last lady. But no, 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 no offense, no offense, no, no offense. No, I, I just want to apologize ahead of time. No offense, okay? Only God knows who advice I'm going to be reviewing to us. And of course, you happens to be maybe one of his best friend's sister. <coughs> No offense at the same time. All right, we'll just leave the game off. So any IT shall we're waiting towards that day. And of course, he said the red carpet is starting by five. And of course, the main event kicks off by six. No African man time. Those in the state, where can they get their ticket? I forgot to say. Okay, that. at um, Market Square. Okay, all Market Square. Um, Water Cup Mall Film House. Okay. Garden City Mall Film House. Okay. The Pleasure Park okay. Film House. I'm Cada excited Cinema. about advice. If you call that number displaying, that number on this ticket, on the flyer, he's the one that will pick the call. He doesn't have PA to pick up a ticket. <laughs> It, 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 there is no fear. It, this thing has to do with money. So, <laughs> that not is, like I have trust issue, but there is no money. PA. There is no PA. Uh, PA does not pick us. Say mm, we're bringing tickets. To, like, he's yeah, definitely I'll bring that. To So, you, imagine though. advice are coming with his own hand to give you a ticket. Um, we're going to have a ticket of 5,000. But, you know, about give up yourself. Now, instead of bringing, just say, okay, because now they come, make I buy for 50K. Okay, okay, unless they buy one bundle. A bundle, uh, yeah, that's why, because that's why the advice is coming. All right, I'll see, you, we'll see you again, same station, same time next week. Always keep your swag on, because that's the best thing for you to do. Next week, we are going to be bringing the one and only Avizi Baba on this platform, and he's going to be telling us what he did with the 10 million naira the governor gave to him. The past governor, I'll say so, gave to him. Until then, I want to say thank you, guys, for coming. Thank keep you. your hands on. Bye for now. Bye.